Hello everyone! Welcome ulit sa aking YouTube channel. So, sa video na ito, ipapakita ko paano natin i, uh, i-remote access yung isang certain PC and at the same time, i-configure na rin natin para ma-remote access natin yung Microtik. Okay? So, now we will be using any desk. Now, at the same time, um, on this video, makikita nyo kung paano i-utilize yung app. Um, open lang natin yung ating browser and then download muna natin. So, type lang, uh, download any desk. And itong first, click nyo lang yan. Then, get any desk for Windows. Since, yes, Windows comment natin. And there, uh, downloads lang pa rin na file. So, save lang natin doon. Wait lang din natin matapos ma-download. Then, yes. Tapos na guys. Uh, we need to do is to click it lang. Open natin. And uh, let's wait na may lumabas dito na number. There. So, there you have it guys. Now, let's start guys. So, of course, let's go to remotewinbox.com. Again. And um, we need to log in sa ating account. Uh, para mag-create na naman ng new script para sa bagong mycotic na i-configure natin. So, login lang yung account na kinate nyo. And yung password. Okay. There. Now, like what I've said on my previous video, um, Itong part na to is necessary if kailangan na nating i, um, i um, what do you call this? Uh, kailangan na nating i-remote access yung um, certain na certain router na gagamitin natin. Now, for now, hindi ko muna i-click yung fix it since kailangan pa nating gumawa ng or kailangan pa nating mag-add ng router. Okay? So, this is my second router na i-add. So, with the nickname again, um, kayo nang bahala kung nung gusto nyong ilagay. Now, since um, Glenn Mar yung nakanime sa vendo na uh, i-remote natin, Glenn Mar na rin ang ilalagay ko dito. Glenn Vendo. Para mas madali kong ma-identify. And yes, as always, 8291 lang ilagay natin dito. Support para ma-access natin through Winbox na app. And again, just choose any number here. So far, 192 ginagamit ko. Um, yes, no reasons at all. Just 192 lang. And then, submit natin. Okay, so there you have it, guys. So, meron na tayong script. So, all we need to do is to copy and paste it sa ating, um, all we need to do is to copy and paste it sa ating Microtech. Okay. And, uh, here comes the AnyDesk, guys. So, paano to gamitin? Once downloaded na, all you need to do is to open it, automatic mag install or ma-open na yan. Now, ito yung pinaka-importante sa app na ito, itong number. It's like your cellular number or identification. Kung meron na tayong e remote, uh, we need to reach out sa kung sino mang pwedeng mag-open ng PC nila or laptop nila para ma-open yung any disk. Dapat uh, running yung app and at the same time, dapat lumabas tong number. So, um, nakausap ko na yung kapatid ko. So, that's 514-387-874. So, yes, nakausap ko na yung kapatid ko. Sa, sinabihan ko na siya na i-open yung... Um, any desk doon sa PC and sinabihan ko na rin na mag-wait siya Oh, my music pa <laughs> So, connected na po tayo guys oh, yeah. Ayan. So, there um, out muna natin tong ano niya. Yun. So, and by the way guys, that's my niece. 
Be bang cute. Okay, so let's start na po. So first, um yes, we need to open Winbox. Ayay, para wala pang Winbox dito. Okay, so um we have to download it first. So open tayo ng um browser. Then type lang natin download Winbox. waiting guys. Now, um, it's very important guys na alam niyo yung specs ng PC nyo. So, kasi um, under this Winbox option, meron tayong option na 64-bit and 32-bit. So, sa PC na yun, para na rin ma-sure mas natin, um, what you can do is uh, click lang yung Windows icon and then type nyo DX Diag. And then, enter lang, or open yun lang yan. And, um, yes, click lang lang yes. Then, let's wait for it to load, or pop out. Yes lang natin to. Yes, so, there you have it, guys. So, operating system, that's Windows 10, 64-bit. So, we're done. Sure na tayo kung ano yung download natin. So, uh, pwede na natin ito i-close. Yun. So, now, let's choose 64-bit. Click na natin ma-download. Okay. Tapos tapos na. Open lang natin. And, uh, yes. Hello, access. Okay, so, uh, meron na tayong winbox. So, what we can do now is close muna natin to ibang browser para makapag-focus tayo dito sa um, ating winbox. So, ngayon guys, um, since connected na to sa same network we're in, um, saan merong microtic, automatic lalabas to. Itong MAC address IP uh, ng microtic itself. So, wala ka ng problema doon. Um, all you need to do is just to click that and then type mo na rin yung password. Okay, connect natin. Okay, done. So, open na. Okay, so, again, remember the video na um, in-upload ko um, the last time. So, first, need natin tong i-copy and paste dito sa um, new terminal. For this um, remote process, at ang gagawin natin is that diretso na lang natin i-change or i-edit yung name and login credentials. So, first, copy lang natin to Here. Then, paste natin. Um, change na natin view to or format to world wrap. Okay, there. Ito yung para sa ano natin, interface. At ito yung para sa filter rules. At dito, at dito naman yung um, sa credentials. So, um, same pa rin. Lagay natin dito is uh, remote admin. And for the password, hindi ko na ipapakita sa inyo guys. Siyempre, yung group natin, dapat natin gabuhin. Dapat full yan. Okay, so, now we're done. Uh, copy lang natin. 
and punta ulit tayo sa any desk then then so inbox um paste lang natin check muna natin ulit. So, interface. Nandiyan na. We also have the IP and the uh, filter rules natin. So, nandiyan na rin siya. Which is good. And yung um, and yung account natin. Yes. So, hindi ko nalang papakita. Okay. So, now, ngayon, subukan natin dito sa ating PC. Oh, sorry. Ah, yes. Subukan natin ngayon dito sa atin PC. So, first, copy natin to. And, yes, yung ginawa natin um, login. Which is yung remote. Admin. Tapos yung password natin. Which is Okay, now open natin yung Winbox. You know, so copy natin yung and yung remote admin at saka yung password. Okay, so subukan natin guys. Again, try natin. Um, currently ibang um, Mac address to since I'm also using a Microtic right now so of course iba yan but hindi dapat natin i-click yan so bagoy natin ulit para hindi mag error so yun na um, then subukan natin connect logging in na do and downloading na po guys Subukan natin. Waiting. Um, normal lang talaga guys na medyo matagal siya. Again, depende rin kasi yan sa internet nyo at internet ng nilay remote nyo. Wait lang natin. And at the same time guys, kung titignan natin yung um, oh, sorry. Na-open na pala. So, yun guys. There. Kung titignan natin guys, tingnan nyo yung remote. Merong um, nagpa-flow na data. So, that means we're really connected na. Woohoo! So, there you have it guys. So, ganun lang kadali uh, mag-remote access ng ating Microtic and at the same time mag-remote access ng PC. That's all for today guys. Again, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And that's it. Thank you for watching.